Hello everyone, my name is Sitranj and welcome back to our video. So today we are going to do the introduction of chemistry equipment. So let's begin. So first is the beaker. A beaker is a glass container with a flat bottom which is used to hold the liquid. The boat span is a piece of scientific equipment intended to support other pieces of equipment and glass wear. So now is the spatula. Spatula is used to transfer chemicals from the original container to other vessels or containers for weighing. Now is the mortar. Mortar is a vessel in which substances are ground or crushed with a pestle. Bunsen burner. The Bunsen burner consists of a flat base with a straight tube extending vertically. Funnel. Funnel is a tube or pipe that is wide at the top and narrow at the bottom. It is used for guiding liquid or powder into a small opening. Petri dish. Petri dish is a shallow flat bottom dome with a lid. It is made up of glass or plastic. Batriot. Batriot is a graduated glass tube with a tap at one end for delivering known volumes of a liquid, especially in titrations. Now is the test tube holder. Test tube holder is used to test tube to tubes. It is used for holding a test tube in place when the tube is hot or should not be turned. Wire gauge. Wire gauge is a thin sheet of metal that has net-like patterns or a wire mesh. Round bottom flask. Round bottom flask is a type of flask having the spherical bottom. Test tube. A test tube, also known as a culture tube or sample tube, is a common piece of laboratory glassware consisting of a finger-like length of glass or clear plastic tubing, open at the top and closed at the bottom. Now is the tripod stand. Laboratory tripod stand is a three-legged platform used to support flasks and beakers. So the next one is the tongs. Tongs is used to hold test tubes. It is used for holding a test tube in place when the test is sure not being touched. 